Hi friends, today we are going to discuss about the acid, base and buffers. In this chapter, we have discussed about the introduction, buffer equation and buffer capacity in general, buffers in pharmaceutical system, preparation stability, buffered isotonic solutions, measurement of tonicity, calculation and method of adjusting isotonicity. Acids and bases are defined by four main theory. First, we have discussed about the introduction part. Acids and bases are defined by four main theory. First one, traditional theory or general concept. Second one, Arrhenius theory. Third one, bronsted lowry theory. Fourth one, Lewis theory. First one, general concept. General concept. Acid is, acids are the substance which convert blue litmus paper to red. Having the pH less than 7, they have sore taste. When react with a base, they form salt and water. Example, hydrochloric acid. Next, base. According to general concept, base are the substance which convert red litmus paper to blue. As it is, substance which convert blue litmus to red. But in base, they convert red litmus paper to blue. They are having pH greater than 7. They have bitter taste. When react with the acid, they form salt and water. Example of the base, sodium hydroxide, NaOH. Next is Arrhenius theory. They are also known as Arrhenius theory of ionization or electron dissociation theory. In this theory, Define acids and bases according to their formation of ions when dissolved in water. Acids, according to Arrhenius theory, acid is a substance that can release H plus ion or hydrogen ion when dissolved in water or a substance which when dissolved in water gives H plus ion or hydrogen ions. This is known as acid. An acid is a substance that can that can release H plus ion when dissolved in a water. Example, hydrochloric acid, HCl. When dissolved in a water, they form H plus and Cl minus. They release H plus ion. Base. Base is a substance that can be released OH minus ion or hydroxyl ions when dissolved in a water. Or a substance which when dissolved in a water give OH minus ion. That is known as base base example sodium hydroxide NaOH when dissolved in a water they form OH minus ion and Na plus next third one bronsted lowry theory bronsted lowry concept according to lowry bronsted theory acid is a proton donor acid is a proton donor base is a proton acceptor they are also known as a proton donor acceptor concept they are also known as in this theory are also known as proton donor acceptor concept example acid hcl they form h plus plus cl minus they release h plus Acid is a proton donor. They donate on proton. This is H+. Next example is acetic acid. CH3COOH. They form CH3CO- minus plus H+. Plus. Base. Base is a proton acceptor. They can accept proton. OH- minus plus H+. Plus. They form H2O. OH minus, they can accept a proton, H plus. They form H2O. Next example, H2O plus H plus. H2O plus H plus, they form H3O plus. They form hydronium ion, H3O plus. NH3 react with H plus. NH3 react with H plus. H plus is a proton acceptor. Therefore, base is a proton acceptor. Ammonia is a base. They can accept a proton. They form NH4 plus ammonium ion. NH4 plus. In this, 
Lowry Bronsted concept they can also divide conjugate acid base pairs when react with HCl react with H2O HCl is a acid H2O is a base to form H3O plus hydronium ion plus Cl minus this H3O plus is a conjugated acid conjugated acid Cl minus is a conjugated base fourth one Lewis concept they are also known as electron donor receptor system they are also known as electron donor receptor system according to Lewis concepts as it is a electron pair receptor base is an electron pair donor in ammonia they can one lone pair of electron is there this one pair lone pair of electron they act with H they form NH3H Lewis theory what is the Lewis theory it is a process of neutralization it is a process of neutralization simply the formation of a coordinate bond between an acid and base simply the formation of a coordinate bond between acid and base that is Lewis theory according to Lewis theory it is a process of neutralization and simply the formation of coordinate bond between acid and a base pH pH is a negative logarithm of H plus ion concentration that is pH negative logarithm of H plus ion concentration that is pH pH is measured by using pH scale is there the ranges from 0 to 40 with the 7 is neutral 7 is neutral the pH of less than 7 that indicate the acid pH of less than 7 that indicate the acidity whereas pH greater than 7 that indicate the base next topic buffer solution the solution that are able to resist the change in pH value that is known as buffer solution the solution that are able to resist the change in pH value that is known as buffer solution it consists of mixture of weak acid and its salt or of a weak bases and salt or a mixture of weak bases and its salt the buffer solution the solution that are able to resist the change in pH value it consists of mixture of weak acid and its salt that is known as acidic buffer solution one example is uh, acidic buffer solution is acetic acid and a sodium acetate acetic acid sodium acetate is their salt next uh, basic buffer that is a mixture of weak bases and its salt one example ammonia and ammonia is a weak base and ammonium chloride that is weak salt and its salt is the example of buffer solution there are two type of buffer solution is the acidic buffer and a basic buffer thank you